narrowing is showing you how you should deal with data types when you write the code. Let me show you an example directly. So let me create a function. I'll say function test. Now assume that I have a parameter a which can be a number that is a numeric type or it can be a string type. So this is what a union type is. Now because a can be a number or a string if I just try any method which is specific to a data type let's say I give a dot to uppercase for example. Now when I do this here you can see that it is showing me to uppercase does not exist on type string or number which is not actually the case. It actually does not exist on type number that's a fact. Now here this is somewhere you can narrow down that is you can put more validations to make sure that your code is precise. So it is just an approach of narrowing down to the specific types and putting more validations. What am I going to do here is I'll put the if condition and I'm going to say type of. If the type of A is let's say string then suddenly I want to apply. Now you can see that there is no issue at all. For example if you have a numeric function let's say I have this function that is to uppercase. Now this is a kind of function which is applied only on the numeric types. So here what I can do a dot to fix. I can just put an else condition or maybe an if condition together if and else together. A if it is number then I want to apply this I'll say type fix to function. So here it doesn't show any problem but if I put it here or even if I put it outside the if condition it is going to show me the problem that to fixed is not available for a specific type. So the way you write the code is basically the concept of narrowing that is you try to narrow down the types and apply the methods accordingly by putting the if condition and using the type of operator. And if you check the official documentation, let me go to the official documentation. I'll say TypeScript and let's open the documentation. Here, if I click on the docs, you can see that narrowing is one of the concepts highlighted on the main page. If I click here, so it is showing that when you have a union type you do take care by using the type of operator you put an if condition like here you can see that it says type of padding is number then it's going to apply something otherwise it's going to do something else. So practically it doesn't give you any error because the JavaScript code anyway gets converted but you are making sure by narrowing down that the code which you have written does have the specific type of methods applied. Here we also have one more thing you can see that type guards now these are just fancy terms actually it is the type of operator which returns these values so basically you can compare like I have already written in this code where string and number so how do I come to know this of course you can directly print the type of and you will get this value but here in the documentation also you have these explained that type of type guards it's just a fancy name that they have used for these values so it is just type guards that's what they call it. So to conclude narrowing is just a concept but it's good to know when you are dealing with TypeScript.